Happy Hearts Month! O, oh, di ba? Pinractice ko yan. So, kung halimbawa, hindi ka pa masyadong comfortable makipag-date sa labas, bakit hindi ka nalang magluto ng something special for your special someone, for your family, and for yourself? So, eto, tong episode natin ngayon is Bonggang Bonggang Valentine's Dinner or lunch, or kung gusto mong midnight snack, or kung gusto mong bongga yung breakfast, push lang. So, simula natin, kasi medyo madami tayong lulutuin ngayon. And I promise you, lahat ito ay social pero napakadaling gawin, but ultimately, mapapahanga at lalo silang maiinlove sa'yo. So anyway, wala nang madaming introduction. Simula natin sa ating rice. Hindi pwedeng walang rice ang mga dinner, dinner natin. Madami tayong luluto and may steak, may salmon, may salad, may special sauce, may mga social na butter, but rice is life. So this is lemon herb rice. Ang social na mapakinggan, di ba? Ang rice nilalagyan ng lemon, ang medyo mas magiging refreshing kasi pag nilagyan natin ng lemon. So, I start with rice. This is just two cups. Binuksan ko na yung apoy. Basically, isasaing mo lang yan. And lalagyan ko ng three cups of water. And into this, I'm also going to put butter. Two tablespoons. And this is chopped parsley leaves. Two to three tablespoons. Just mix it like that. And then into this, I'm going to put grated lemon zest. Make sure na tinatakpan namin ng cling wrap para hindi hindi ko mawala yung mga essential oils. You get all the nice aroma. So this is perfect especially if you're pairing it with fish or seafood, no nagba-balance. Okay? That's it. And then iwan mo lang 'yan diyan. If you want to use a rice cooker, go ahead. Okay, so now let's prepare potato salad. Napakasimpleng gawin. I have here some potatoes that I've boiled earlier. Pinakuloan ko to uh, for around 10 minutes. Alright, so until fork tender, you just put it here. Nako, baliktad. Baliktad po, nagkamali. Balik natin. Na-excite ako. Mauuna pala yung dressing. O diba, pinapakita ko lang na pag ganitong... Buwan na mga puso. Medyo nalilito-lito na tayo and okay lang yon. I have your hard-boiled eggs. Nire-recycle ko lang itong aking, uh, anong tawag dito? Kaserola. Kasi gusto ko colorful. Diba? And then I'm using a potato masher para hindi na ako mag-chop-chop-chop-chop ng eggs. O, oh, ba? Mash mo lang na ganyan. Hard-boiled eggs. And then good mayonnaise. Just put good mayonnaise. Pickle relish. Chopped red onions. And spring onions. Just mix this together. And you want to season it with some salt. Ground black pepper. And a bit of white sugar. You can prepare this in advance o para fresh ka pa din sa araw ng mga puso. Okay. Oh, eto, meron ka ng instant, ano to, egg salad. Pwede mo na itong pang pahid sa mga tinapay. Sarap. You put the potatoes. And we mix. Kaya magandang uunahin mo to kasi for the potato salad, magandang ma-ref mo. This is best served chilled. Okay? You just mix it until it's been coated with your dressing. May mga nahulog. So, akin na to. 
Mm. I'll think I'll, I'll put a little bit more salt. Okay, that's it. Tatakpan lang natin ng cling wrap and then ilalagay ko to sa Just give your rice a quick mix. Okay, next, another component. Ito naman pwede natin ilagay sa steak, pwede sa fish, sa rice, or sa tinapay. This is the compound butter. Before, nagpakita na ako nito in one of my videos. Pero, ulitin natin. O, oh, diba? Para talagang special ang Hearts Month. Hearts Day. Para every day is Hearts Day. So, I just have here salted butter. You just put like a cup. Hindi naman kailangan sukat na sukat. ba? Ang butter, ang pagmamahal, hindi yan sinusukat. Binubuhos lang yan. So, buhusan mo ng parmesan cheese or any available cheese that you have. Basta kailangan lang is grated. So, if you have queso de bola, you can use queso de bola. This is fresh parsley. I have here thyme. You can also use rosemary. A bit of paprika for that smoky flavor and color. A bit of minced garlic. And black pepper. You want to use yung black pepper na medyo coarse. Kagaya nito. Okay. So basically, kung anong favorite mo, yon ang ilagay mo dyan. Kasi when you say compound butter, ayan no, it's just butter that you're going to flavor. And then, just using fork, dalawang fork, iganyan mo lang. You can put sun-dried tomatoes kung gusto mo medyo maanghang, ay dilagyan mo ng sile oh de ba so napakagandang surprise nito alam mo ba isa surprise mo yung asawa mo oh de ba ano mga favorite flavors mo pag sasamahin ko sa butter i'm going to make compound butter it's very important that you start with room temperature butter kat katulad nito yung medyo spreadable consistency para hindi ka mahihirapan and then, of course, feel free to try it. <laughs> Yung last feeling po, lalong ma-i-inlove sa akin ng jowa ko nito. ba? Oh my God. Mm. Sige, ibalot na yan. And get ready for dinner. So, you have many options. Pwede mo tong i-pipe. Pwede mo tong bilog-bilugin. Pero ako, ayaw kong pahirapan ng sarili ko. Ayaw kong ma-stress. So, kukuha lang ako ng clean wrap. Ah, ito. May clean wrap ako. Ayaw kong pahirapan ng sarili ko. Ay, ayan. Ayaw kong pahirapan ng sarili ko. Yung clean wrap, dumidikit-dikit na. Ayan. Okay. Just put it like that. Ngayon mo lang siya. Bibilog ko lang. Just form it into a nice lug. Nakikooperate ang butter. Into a nice lug. And then you just put it into the fridge. So this one, you can always prepare this ahead of time. So now let's prepare the steak sauce. So if you want the traditional gravy, meron tayong video niyan, marami tayo. Yung burger steak, yung ating pork steak. But today, parang naaalala ko, kasi ngayong panahon, di ba? Ang sarap pumunta sa Japan, malamig doon, masarap may kayakap ka doon, holding hands while walking. Oh, di ba? So, na naalala ko bigla, there is a very famous restaurant sa talambuhay ko, no? Hindi po ako mahilig pumila, pero dito sa restaurant na to, napapila po ako ng isang oras. This is the Ikinari Steak. 
It's famous in Tokyo, but they have branches all over Japan. Tatlong beses po kami pumila dahil yung kapatid kong napakahilig sa steak. Talagang kinumbinsi kami, imagine, sa kalamigan, winter, ata kami nandun, winter or fall, I fall for you. Pumila po kami dun sa labas, pero ito naman yung paghihintay na talagang sulit. So, sinubukan kong gayahin yung sauce, and mukha namang successful, so gawin natin. So, this works, this sauce works with any steak. Sa beef, sa pork, sa chicken, sa fish, sa tofu, bagay na bagay. So first, I'm going to start, nasa na ba ang aking kodigo? I'm going to start by putting into the blender, of course, my favorite Japanese soy sauce, kikuman. You just put around 3 fourth cup of kikuman soy sauce into the blender. Alright, that's around 3 fourth cup. And then you just put around 2 tablespoons of mirin. Kapag ka wala kang mirin, you can just replace it with apple juice or dagdagan mo na lang yung orange juice. And then you just put a splash of orange juice. Just a splash. And you put brown sugar. Garlic, minced garlic, just a bit. Yung brown sugar, you can also adjust it depending on on your preference. Kung ayaw mo na masyadong matamis, pwede naman bawasan. Ginger, this is grated ginger. You also adjust depending on your liking. Pwede mong dagdagan, pwede mong bawasan. And then this is one piece of white onion. You just put it there and then you just crush it. Okay, that's it. So, pagka smooth na yan, oh, ayan, smooth na. Ayan, ang bango. Amoy Japan. Yung parang na, makikipag-date ako sa Japan. And then, ayan, na blender na natin. Papakuluan mo lang yan. Lulutuin mo lang dito sa yung small casserola. Lagyan mo lang ng konting slurry. This is just cornstarch na may konting tubig. Para lang lumapot siya ng konti. Konti lang. Ayan. So, papalaputin lang natin ng konti yan. And then, you, you want it like that na may konting buo-buong onions. So, you will just wait for this one to boil. So, once it boils, ayan, makikita mo, oh, ayan, nice, di ba? Nang sauce mo. Hindi po siya parang teriyaki. Iiba siya. Talagang parang steak sauce. No? So, yan. Ayan. You just leave it like that. And then, I, I just put it here on one side. And then, we can cook the side vegetables. Yung para lang mas bongga yung ating steak. So, let's just cook buttered vegetables. Very, very simple. I just have here some butter. And then I'm going to cook first the carrots kasi mas matagal maluto ang carrots. Then put some a little bit of water, just a splash. And then over here ni re ready ko na yung lulutuan natin ng ating mga steak. Okay, and then I have here some asparagus. Mahaba po 'yan, tinanggal ko na po yung Matigas na part. For the asparagus, sosote ko lang ng konti yan. I don't want to overcook it. Same as with the carrots. Para may konting crunch pa rin. Tikman natin. Mm. Perfect. I'll turn off the flame. And then I'll just leave it here. So over here, I'm preparing yung ating mga Proteins. So, I have here first, salmon. Okay, ito pwede mong gamitin pang sigang. Pwede mo din naman lutuin yan dyan. But for special occasions like this, maganda ang ginagamit natin is the nice filet. Ayan, ganyan. Medyo cut it a, a little bit thicker than the usual para hindi basta-basta na-dry. 
okay? And then I have here some nice shrimps. And I have here some rib eye steak na binili ko lang sa, sa grocery. So the first uh, thing that you want to do is, you want to preheat your uh, mga lutoan. So I'm using all cast iron. I'm going to grill the steak here. I'm going to cook the salmon and the shrimp dito din sa aking dalawang plancha or skillet, cast iron skillet. You want your skillets or your your griddle to become very very hot, no? Para maganda ang pagkaluto. Ganun lang ka simple yan. Tapos na tayo sa sauce. Luto na din yung ating lemon rice. The potato salad is waiting for us inside the fridge. Ang bango ng lemon rice. Bongga. Para mas bongga yung lemon rice, finish it with some butter. Bango-bango. Alam mo yung amoy sosyal. Yung kanin lang, nilagyan mo lang ng lemon zest. Parang basta. O, subukan mo para ma-explain ma -explain mo sa sarili mo. Make sure it's very, very hot. Me, when I cook steak, I always season after cooking. Yung iba naman, before cooking, they, they already season with salt. Nasa sayo yan. Ako lang, preference ko lang talaga yon na after cooking, that's the only time that I put the salt. No? You put a bit of oil. This is just plain cooking oil. And then for this, you just brush it real quick. And then when you're cooking mga ganyang high flame, make sure na buksan mo yung exhaust or buksan mo ang mga bintana. Okay, pag umuusok-usok na yan, makikita mo, oh, kung medyo umuusok na, nagpaparamdam na yung mga kawali mo. Okay? Uunahin ko sa steak. I like my steak medium. So, pagka medium, mga around 3 minutes, 3 to 4 minutes per side. Mm. Then, I put the prawns. I'm putting the prawns. Shrimp lang pala. Hindi kalakihan ng aking napabili today. And then, the salmon filet. You don't want to overcook. Especially the, the shrimp and the salmon. Mabilis lang po ito. Ito yung pinapaliwanag ko sa inyo. Pag maganda yung init ng kawale, no? it's perfectly cooked. See? Lakasan lang natin ng konti ito. Natatakpan na po ako. Okay, this is cooked. Nice, look. Oh, di ba? Bongga, may grill mark. The salmon is also cooked. Look at the nice crust. I'm going to season it with salt and pepper. You don't want to overcook it. I just want it medyo medium. And you get that nice grill mark. Uh, Iteche ko kung napatay ko ang aking mga apoy. Alright. Para mas bongga, naisip ko, magluto tayo ng foie gras. O, diba? So, madali lang lutuin to. Actually, mabibili mo to ng ganito na. So, in, in a non-stick pan, luto lang tayo ng dalawang piraso. Okay? And as I cook that, I have here the rice. Mag-plate na ako nung for the seafood. Okay? So, meron kang rice dito. Just put it there sa gitna. O, diba? Ito yung 
sosyal na rice. This is the lemon rice. Gusto mo lang pabonggahin ng konti. Malagyan mong tatlong pirasong asparagus dito sa gilid. Ay, ayan, nahulog tuloy. Nagpapabongga pa kasi. O, nahulog. Wala namang masama, ba? Diba? O, para, para nag-fine dining ka sa, sa bahay nyo. Okay, you wipe. And then, o, oh, kung anong gusto, salmon. Pwede mong ilagay dyan sa gitna yung salmon. Pwede din sa gilid. I think I'm going to put it sa gitna. But I'm going to put some, this is, ano ba to? Arugula. Baby arugula. Buti pa yung arugula, may baby. You put the salmon there. Hindi pa, pa, po, hindi pa po tapos yan. Hindi ako papayag na salmon lang. You put the shrimps here. Laging tatlo para I love you. Isn't it bonga? And then, lalagyan mo dito yan ng compound butter. This is the compound butter. And then, you just slice it. You get the nice side. Oh, pwede ka maglagay dito ng compound butter. Sa gitna ng salmon. And then the shrimps. Lagyan mo nitong iyong nice steak sauce. Oh, di ba? Magpa-fine dining ka pa naman ba? Eh kung kering-kering mo naman magluto ng something special for your special someone, for yourself, for your family. On Valentine's Day, ayan yung kanin ay gumuho na. Oh, di ba? So, dish one. Nagpa-picture ako. Dish one. Oh, para naman sa ang gusto ay steak. Tinatakpan ko po ng foil para manatiling moist. Lagyan natin ng potato salad dito on the side. Oh, di ba? Tapos, lagyan mo ng foie gras. Pero lagyan ko muna ng steak sauce. The Ikinari inspired steak sauce. Look how bonga. Your Valentine dinner. Steak with foie gras. Oh, baka may main love sa akin yan. Diba? Ano pa bang combination ng gusto mo? Gusto mo may truffle pasta? Manood ka lang ng video. Picturean ko lang po ito. Ha ha. O oh, ayan, siguro naman marapat lang na tikman ko yung niluto ko. Kahit wala akong kadate, ide-date ko yung sarili ko ngayon. This is the lemon rice with the salmon and the compound butter. Tikman ko nga muna. Oy, perfectly cooked yung salmon. Moist na moist ang loob. Mm. Ay, kakaiba yung compound butter. Lasang sosyal. The lemon rice. Mm. Yung lemon rice ko ang pinakamadali. Pero feeling ko, sa totoo lang ha, honestly, yung lemon rice ang magdadala ng dinner niya. Mm, Maliit lang po ako ng foie gras kasi, teka nga, kumuha ng steak knife. Naku, nasang ba steak knife ko? Nandun pa sa ilalim. to na lang. Serrated knife. Maliit lang po ako ng foie gras dahil medyo nagjejeta ako. Mm. Mm. Ang sarap po nung sauce. Perfect na perfect. With the potato salad. Mmm. Parang ayaw ko na po umalis dito. Baka hindi na dumating yung kadate ko. Ay, pero ang sarap talaga ng sauce. Parang hindi ka maghahanap ng gravy. Mm. Give me some rice. So good. Huwag ka na maghihintay. Huwag mo nang paghihintayin ang kadate mo. Huwag mo nang paghihintayin ang pamilya mo. Magluto ka na ng ganitong kabongga. Pero kung mapapansin mo, super daling gawin. May dessert po tayo. Sa Sabado, panoorin nyo. So, happy Valentine's to all of you. 
whether you're single, whether you're married, or kung ano man ang status mo sa buhay na katulad ko, <laughs> ang importante, masaya po tayo at nagmamahalan tayong lahat. Take care always and I'm going to see you all soon.